We are all looking for ways to stay safe and to help others, especially the medical professionals on the front lines. But one Burbank dental lab had a unique idea to get more masks to people who really need them. KCAL 9's Jeff Nguyen shows us what they're doing. Tents have been set up outside this hospital for what is expected to be a surge of coronavirus patients, which is why one local family is working nonstop to help by providing something that looks like it's out of a sci-fi movie. In the global battle against the coronavirus pandemic, 3D printers are providing a new coat of armor. It's a 3D printed mask. It's thermoplastic, so it is flexible and it can be molded to your face. Dr. Diana uh, Settler is a dentist it. who hasn't been able to work because of safer at home orders, but she wants to help other medical workers at a time when personal protective equipment like N95 masks are in short supply. She and her brother Andrew have been trying to close the gap. They've given away about 200 3D masks. Dr. Anna Van Sky works at Hollywood Presbytery Medical Center. She was allowed by her hospital to test out the masks. And they've pretty much been a really big hit at this point. Um, our intensivist physician was the one that requested we order more. Dr. Van Sky says the 3D masks can be used over and over by simply wiping them down with alcohol. The design allows for the attachment of filters that are easy to find and affordable. For about 12 pieces which is about $2 a piece, essentially. Um, N95 masks right now online, the cheapest I've seen them is about $6. The settlers aren't in the mask business. Their family owns a Burbank dental lab that normally makes things like crowns and bridges, which was started by their grandparents who immigrated from Russia. Straps are made at home. The family business, now run by their parents, has footed the bill for this mission a mercy. Uh, we came here with nothing. We achieved a lot here and uh, now it's pretty much a time to give back. We're trying to keep as many people as healthy as possible, but our end goal is for them to take off the mask and to smile for us. The settlers say they are not making money from this effort because the masks are not for sale. They've gone through their supply of the base materials so they would appreciate donations to keep it going. In Hollywood, Jeff Nguyen, KCAL 9 News.